Hello everyone, today we're going to take a look at how we can use REM deals, a new feature in Revenue Cloud for Winter 25. All right, so REM deals, so for anyone familiar with CPQ, it's going to be the equivalent or very similar to MDQ in CPQ. So it's going to allow you to create REM, REM segments for your products. So it's going to let you do things like offer free trial periods and create different segment types for your product where you can modify and have different quantities and different pricing on the different <clears throat> on the different ramps, right? So for example, you can have a free trial up front and then multiple yearly ramps where you have a different quantity per year. So year one, you're selling quantity of 10, then 15, then 20 for year three. Or, and then you can also have custom segment types in there. All right, so let's jump into Salesforce and see how we can set that up. All right, so from the product catalog management app, let's go in and create a new product. All right, let's call this simply demo ramp product set this to active uh, availability let's set that to the beginning of the month uh, not much specific to set up on there that's going to be different than your regular products so you can go in we don't want to bundle for this you can just create a standard product once your product is created and related as you would with a standard product you're going to want to create your product selling model option so let's set that as a yearly term defined product proration policy is the default one let's hit save all right once your product selling model option is defined you can also add your price book entry let's add our price Let's say that our standard list price is 8,000 and call out to your product selling model again to yearly, save. All right, so on your product, you're gonna notice a new related list, product REM segments. So that's where you're gonna set up your REM segments that are available for this product. So let's hit new. And we're first gonna create our yearly segments before we set up a free trial segment as well for that product. All right, so product selling model option. Let's select our yearly product selling model option and segment type. We're going to leave to yearly. Hit save. All right, so that's our first segment type for this product. And then back on our product, we're going to create a second REM segment for this product. Let's again choose yearly as our product selling model option. But now the segment type is going to be free trial. Duration will set to months. And then we're going to define that as three months initially. Let's hit save. All right, so that's all the setup you need to do on your product. Now you need to make sure, as usual, that your product is assigned to a catalog so that it's visible when you go in and add it to your product. So let's add it to the catalog that already exists in this test environment. Let's create a new category for this. We'll call it ramp, give it an order. All right, and let's simply assign that new ramp product demo REM product to this category and save. And as usual, once you've gone through all these steps in Revenue Cloud, you want to make sure you go to setup and you sync your pricing data so that it's available to add on quotes. So let's go under pricing setup and we're going to hit sync pricing data, confirm. All right, the data is syncing so we can go back. Let's go on the sales app and create a a new quote to test this out. Let's go on quote, create a new one. Define what you would define normally, give it a name. Define your account if you need to. And it's save. That's going to take us to our quote. At this point, the pricing data sync should be completed. So we can go to <clears throat> browse catalogs. We select our predefined catalog, select our price book. All right, and now under your new category, you've got your new demo REM products. So we're going to add this to our quote. <coughs> add it to your quote. Let's first hit save. The product is going to save as is to your quote with its standard price. And now on the right hand side on the down arrow, you're going to have a new option to ramp that specific line. So if you hit on ramp, now you can define the subscription term in months. 
let's call it three years, 36 months. And do you want to offer a trial or no? Yes, defaults to 90 days. And now you can generate your segments. All right, there you go. So now from the start date, you generate a free trial with 100% discount on there. And then you've got year one, year two, year three. And from this screen, you can modify the quantity by year. So let's say that year one, you want to sell a quantity of five. Year two, you're selling a quantity of 10. And year three, you're selling a quantity of 20. And then the discount also goes up as you progress through the years because they're getting using more quantities. And you can make all those changes. And if we add instant pricing, this would update. Now we can update our segments. This is saved and we can hit save. All right, so now the line looks slightly different, right? Once you've uh, completed your work on there, you see the discount percentage, which really represents your free trial. The quantity is only the quantity for your trial period. But if you hover over total price, you're all going to see the yearly pricing for the full three year and the trial. And the net total represents the full net total over the entire contract term that you're selling this for. All right, so this was how you use REM deals in the Revenue Cloud as of Winter 25. I hope this was an helpful intro. As usual, if you've got any questions, please reach out. If you like the content, please subscribe. We're going to keep it coming. Have a good day.